Let me see if it's picking up my mic. There it is. It is picking up my mic. Close it down a little bit. Aha. Hello. Welcome everyone. Iris here. Today we're looking at Harvest Moon One World. Today is the release day that this is being recorded. I've seen it not. I knew it was coming. I've seen the updates, but I haven't watched nothing on it. I'm really looking for story, the new story of seasons at, at the end of the month. But let's look at this. I want to play it. Look at it. Who has quit? Confirm. I'm just going to leave him basic. That's what I always do. Ryan, let's change it down. To my E R U S. Yes. Hey, let's confirm it. All right, my birth, the birth date. I want them to go winter of 18. Give us a good time to build up relationships and stuff and start before I get anything. Yes. Now, I don't know what this game consists of, but, <clears throat> well, it's Harvest Moon game, but I don't know a whole, whole lot about it. You understand what I'm saying? It can be a little bit confusing. Once long ago, a world rich in resources flourished under us pieces of the harvest goddess. Creatures great smile throughout across its verdant landscape. Fruits and vegetables grew in abundance and all year, all year round. Its people lived in peace and harmony, grateful for the blessing of the harvest goddess. Fishing at daybreak, working in the fields, tending to livestock. Days were filled with countless things to do. And yet each task was necessary to ensure a life of plenty. See what this game has to offer. <laughs> oh, Iris, could you come here a minute? Use the left stick and move. Press A to stop talking from somebody. Okay, left stick. Let's see, why is my bag important items? B's back. Left, right, left, right. Okay, it zooms in and out. Anything to put? Oh. All right, let's go talk to Mother. I guess it's Mother. I don't know. Yep, Mom. He looks. It looks like we're running a bit low on potatoes. Would you mind talking to Doc and go look for more? Hee <laughs> hee, that would be great. If you found something else to eat besides potatoes. Now, you be careful out there. You hear? Come back safe. Can I go in there? No. Can't do nothing in here. No, no, no. Could you and Doc go harvest some potatoes for me, dear? you really be helping me out. Yeah. Kind of familiar starting spot. Compared to the past, same about the past as a few, again. other past two harvest moons. Cough, cough. Doc 
Gerald Jr. Well, that's weird. Could have sworn I got wiring right. Wonder what went wrong. Huh? Oh, it's you, Iris. New seeds. That'll be that'll be the day. Still nose deep in that old book. Glean anything new off of it. No, eh. Well, maybe you'll find something later. That book really is all you think about, isn't it? Hey, no need to be get upset. It's the truth, right? Come on, let's rustle up some food. Gotta be some, gotta be some potatoes at least. <laughs> Go this way, I guess. Well, what do you expect? We don't find anything around where we, when we checked it out before either. The only place you'll find a full crop of veggies is in that book of yours. Anywho, if we got time to talk, we've got time to look for potatoes. Say now, don't you tell me you've forgotten how to look, have you? Crops and other items can be obtained by pressing A and A button. Press and A. Press and A. Alright, I guess let's go over here. Can't pick it up. There we go. Oh, look like you found one. Looks like you found one. Of course, it's a potato. That's all everyone finds around in these parts, after all. Hey, we are getting all mad about. Calm down already. Tomato, cabbage, carrot? Never heard of them. Are those vegetables you learned about that book in that book of yours? Yes. I hate to tell you, but it's just a fairy tale. Be realistic, buddy. And all we've got is potatoes here. Pull yourself together. We gotta scrounge up some more food for your mom. you looking at? I don't see anything. Yeah, I just saw a little glowing thing. You all right, ears? That book's got you seeing things. The only thing really so far that I cannot stand is this slow... Having to hit A, because I mean, it, see the, how slow this is. Hmm, harvest whips, huh? You mean those spirits that help you grow crops. Harvest, harvest whips really do exist. Maybe you could get our hands on some new vegetables. What a sight to see. I've never seen you as excitedly, excitedly excited as this before. Oh, tongue twist. You just go over here. It went this way. Go see what it is. No. Uh -oh. What's going on? Did you really find one? All right, all right, go on, then after it. Dude, what is this? An acorn? There's a whale. Green. I had no idea there was something like this around here. Yeah, it sure looks like a whale to me. I guess someone used it long ago. That weird thing from before is next to the wheel. Hmm, say, hmm, seriously, I don't see anything. If you get too close, it might run off, you know. It's looking at the acorns. You say the thing might be hungry. Tell you what, don't you grab three acorns and give it to them. In the meantime, I'll keep an eye on the wheel. Three acorns. There's my dog barking. Two, three. The dog loves to bark. Ooh, what do you give us? <laughs> Gave you something? It looks like black seed, black beads. Ah, I get it. Those must be some seeds. Just imagine something this small can grow into something as big as a potato. Honestly, I can't picture it. 
In any case, why don't we try growing the seeds yourself? Then we can deduce if that old book of yours is telling the truth or not. Well, we went out of your way to make tools for your seed cultivation. When you, when do you do that exactly? Well, I'm not all that surprised. Right, we'll use them to try to grow that seeds of yours. Let's head to your shed, Iris. Okay, we're in the shed. <laughs> it's just, it's just, <laughs> shit, it looks like a little box. You got a hoe? Great. Then let's find some let's find some fields with potatoes growing in them. Right now, let's read what's written in this book. To grow seeds, first thing you need to do is till the land. Press A button and on highlighted fields to till them. Boom. Okay, that looks pretty good. Next plant the seeds. Press A button to till the field to sow the seeds on. If you have more than one type of seed, press L and R to change them. Turn it. Next, we needed some water. Oh, I'll show you how to get it. You need a watering can first. First, head over the shed by your house and get yourself a watering can. After that, collect some water from the well. The big shed, you know, you can't even fit in it. Press A button near the water to get water from it. All right, one last thing you gotta do now is pour some water on the seed you planted. Yeah, it's same old, same old. You gotta water them. Let's run over here where I planted it. Press A. There she is, watered, watered. Nothing's happening. Wait, a little longer, you say? Sure, why not? Uh, just how much longer is longer? <laughs> I know, I'm just not sure the seeds grow into bits. It was a fairy tale after all. Aw, oh, book up, buddy. Come on, it's time to head home. That's not your fault, friend. We'll get more food tomorrow. Heck, let's take another crack at the book tomorrow, okay? That's the spirit. Oh, and make sure you give those potatoes to your mom. Yeah. Go in here and give them mom. Welcome home, Iris. Give the potatoes in your bag to your mother as a gift. Items you get stored in bag can open your bag by pressing Y. To sort the category, pressing X. The larger your bag is, the more items you can carry in one. Take items you want to give as a gift from your bag and then hold, hold them. Press A button in front of the person you want to give. Food. Hello. There you go. There's my potatoes. I found your mother. Just take them. Take them, take them, take them. We're having potatoes tonight. Certainly do look delicious. Don't look so blue. You can look for new veggies again tomorrow. Trying too hard to find them. I'm sure you will someday, Iris. I bet you're hungry, aren't you? Let's have dinner. Potatoes. What kind of potatoes you give them? Potato salad? Salad and potatoes? You don't know what veggies are and you got lettuce. You got lettuce and... <laughs> they only know, to have, know what potatoes are. <laughs> Eating your fill as always. There's enough for seconds. Don't be shy. My, what a yawn. You must be exhausted after that. Why don't you head to the bed? Press A button in front of your bed. Sleep until the next day. Sleep and restore stamina. Go to sleep. Our first night. I don't snore. Why? The? No. I do snore. But I don't snore. You never know. What is that? Ain't a lot of controlling so far. It's just here, there, a little bit. Dependus, a seed has sprouted. I can hardly believe it. Vite, a new type of character. Oh my, could it be? 
Can you see me? Oh, I see. You must be the one who cultivated the seed. It's thanks to you that I've been revived. I'm so ever grateful. Say, what's your name? Iris Halley. Ho, oh, ho, a wonderful name indeed. My name is Bitte. 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 I'll say Bitte. The Harvest Spirit of Life. I'll butcher it so many, so many times because I try to read it so fast. And I'll just. That's my problem when I read. And I read. Try to read too fast and I butcher a lot of words and stuff. You saw one like me. It must be have been one of my kin. No need to fear. Everyone do not come out. There they are. One, two, three. Hee <laughs> hee, surprised are you? These are harvest wisps. By the way, Iris, what drew you here to such a late hour? Ah, yes, that was the light that shone upon my revival. Normally, humans shouldn't be able to see it. It appears you may possess some mysterious power. If that is so, I believe this may be some divine providence. Oh, ears, why don't you listen to my request? First, allow me to give you this. What do you give me? What do you give me? What is that? This is a medallion. Five others just like it exist somewhere in this world. Would you ask that you seek out the remaining medallions? Gather all six, the harvest goddess will be resurrected. Indeed, she is more than mere myth, but Bountiful Soul, Bountiful Soul was lost from this world. And with it, the goddess's power. Still, she believed that one day the Bountiful Soul would be revived by a faithful hand. That is why the medallions were entrusted to us and turned into the harvest wheat. She scattered them across the world and then disappeared. But she told us that as long as the world had needed need of her, she would return once again. Since you have revived me, I'm as confident you are up to the task. Please lend us your aid. You truly wish to help us? I'm overjoyed. A fairy tale, I'm sure. The real Harvest Goddess is quite real. She may not be up here before us, but she continues to watch over us for all of time. I'll leave it to you, ears. Awaken the harvest spirits from around the world as you you did. As you did, I. Oh, okay. Okay, as you did, I. It's just kidding. As you did. And the medallions are for sure to follow. Then you, then you can restore the bountiful, bountiful soul and bestow the gift of the new bountiful food upon the world. Indeed, thank you. Think of all the food you have. Doesn't it sound wonderful? Harvest Wisp will certainly assist you as well. Changed them up, hadn't it? It's growing. And a whole lot to do here to start. And a lot and lot. Zoom in and out. Can't do nothing with rocks just yet. Whoa, what the... Iris, what do you think you're doing? What do you think you're doing at a time like this? Have some sense. You're still up, so I don't want to hear it. Uh, you lost me, my friend. Harvest spirits, medallions. You okay, buddy? I don't realize today was such a shock. <laughs> I can't say I believe it, but if it's true, this new and bountiful food sounds intriguing. What the heck? I'll buy it. Still, if you're going to travel the world, you'd better be prepared. Travel Bountiful Soul. Eureka! I just had a great idea. I knew I was a genius. <laughs> I have it ready in a jiffy. You just like to go home and crash for the rest of the night. <sighs> hey, Iris, come on out here. We got something really neat to show you. <laughs> me up. Hey, Mom. You got anything to say before I go out? Hee hee hee, that would be great if you found something else to eat besides potatoes. Yeah. What is this? 
Duh. Go up here, look. You're about to be witness to history, ears. Huh? All right, just the squishy stress reliever and, and squeeze as hard as you can. Prepare to be amazed. Okay. Huh. <laughs> Zim Zam Kaboom, I bet you didn't expect this. I call it Expendo Farm. Now you can set up a farm anytime. My own genius truly frightened me. Come on here, let me give you the rundown on your new state-of-the-art Expendo Farm. This is your farm's power source. His name's Sparky. Hello, my name is Sparky. Nice to meet you. Beep beep. Beep bop. Feed him items you save up energy for your farm. Feed me already. I am starving here. All right, already. Go on, ears. Feed him this this to him. Well, he just was all green. See, he's all green. There, he's not. He, not potatoes again. Beep beep. Enough with whining. We're in the same boat as you. Fair enough. I sure you bag filled bar. The amount of energy out of give spark you can see. You know, can be seen on the items information screen. Okay. Give the potato. Fills him up. Guess it'll work a bit. Well, now you've got some working energy. Let's get some work. Listen up, Beers. This here is a mobile farm. Don't forget, it always needs energy to function. Nope, you can't move it like move it like this. To get what I mean, you're pressing Sparky's button. Here's you can store your farms. You can store your farm once Sparky's enough energy reaches its maximum level. Okay. Nope, you can't move it like this. Okay. Magic. Kind of feel like a Pokemon ball. We got a Pokemon ball. A squishy ball. See that building? It's a big new fit. It's the palm in your hand. Easy peasy, right? Still have to to fill a few conditions during the setup. There needs to be enough space to deploy the farm a spot over a bunch of left over. So, bountiful soil is fertile land where people lived long ago. When you find fertile land, activate Sparky. Expand your farm. Don't know how to find a place where you can expand your farm? No need to worry. Sparky will let you know places you can expand your farm when you come across them. Don't worry about it. You'll figure it out when you get there. Now you can expand or shrink your farm at any time. Just find a good spot, throw it, and you'll be on the farm in no time. I can tell you you want to leave right now, but you gotta get some rest. Me too, after all, neither. I pulled. Plus, you gotta tell your mom, right? trip so suddenly yes hee <laughs> hee you made up your mind you never did give up on looking for new vegetables out there understand i'll miss you i'll miss you but this is something you need to do you have my full support as my your mother i know you'll be able to find all sorts of amazing new foods well then it's time to make dinner be sure to eat up so you're ready for tomorrow the potatoes you got for me yesterday were all all gone now so can you go get some more for me Yes. Hehehe, <laughs> would you be great if you found something else to eat besides potatoes? It's okay, you always search so hard. I'm sure you'll find something different to eat today. Hehehe, <laughs> that would be great. Yeah, same thing. She said the same thing. Hey, what happened to the seed you planted yesterday? I couldn't sleep last night thinking about it. Keep an eye on them. Let me know if anything changes. You can check around the train, mini map, located in the bottom right corner. Yeah. Let's go check on our seeds, what we gotta do. Ooh. Can't break no rocks yet. 12 p.m. Oh, there we go. It's grown. 
Boom, a turnip. We got a tournament. Run up here. Check his stuff out. Ain't nothing. Fill my watering can back up. That's it. Ain't a lot to do at the moment to start this game. Just like most of them. It's been a long, long just to get going. Go see Doc. Hey, you wouldn't have to see you playing yesterday. Couldn't play sleep last night. Keep an eye on them. Let me know if you, anything changes. Uh -huh. Said the same thing. Let's go up here and look real fast. We didn't really look up in here. The rock. Can't get by the rock, can we? Ain't nothing up here to grab. The trees. Can we click on trees? Nope. Do, 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 do. Go in. Talk to my Oh, ears. What is this? Can't believe you found a new food for us? Yes. It's called a turnip. You say it, I see. I'm sure to remember that. Alright, now let's eat. It might be a while before we can eat together again like this. I wonder what vegetable you brought me tastes like. Mmm. Turnip. You got a big day tomorrow. You should go to bed early tonight and get ready for your journey. Time has finally come for you to set out on your own. It's a bit of a shock, I must admit, but I know you'll be alright. Just remember your mother believes in you, always. Dude? No, what did she give me? She gave me some stuff. What'd she give you? Come on. He's <laughs> surprised, are you? I made a bag, big, big, bigger, bag bigger. I was reading that bigger, backwards for some reason. I made your bag bigger for you while, while you're sleeping. Fill it up with some new food you find. I can't wait to hear you all about your adventures, Iris. Number of items you hold has increased. That's the end of this episode. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Also, give us a thumbs up, like it would greatly help out the channel. And we'll continue on the next episode. Let's see what goes on. See where this goes. That being said, everybody have a great and wonderful day. Goodbye.